Hi everybody. Apologies for the air conditioner. I actually even got my fan on low here because I was really sweating when I did the just did a video for my main channel. And I was planning to do a video today going up to Mount Pelion here in Trenton, Ontario, which overlooks the whole city, but it's kind of a rainy day, so soon though I'll be doing that. I have a CD, well, I have two CDs to open, one I know what it is and one I don't. And then I'm going to just show you all of the Elvis Costello albums I have now. I think I have 19 of them. So first, I finally have Jefferson Airplane Surrealistic, is that how you say it? Surrealistic Pillow. And I'd never really heard this until the uh, CD exchange with Glenn Kelloway. Took me a few listens, three or four, to really appreciate it. I've always loved this Jefferson Airplane album ever since, probably since it came out. One of my brothers had this, and, and now I have it. I was kind of hope, you know, when I was looking on Amazon, it didn't say if this was mono or stereo because the one Glenn gave me was mono. And I listened mainly with headphones, so I ended up listening to the stereo mix on Spotify for that. So maybe I'll find out when I open this. Grace Slick, one of the greatest female singers ever. Great band, of course. Nice booklet. Yeah, I'm sure it is stereo. It doesn't say <laughs> it doesn't say if it is or isn't, but I'll find out I guess. So let's see what is in this. I bet it's a CD. Maybe it's an, an Elvis. I don't think I have any Elvis Costello coming in. I think I'm all done for now. Ooh. And this is a CD I had in my CD collection. I wonder if this happens to anybody else. There's a couple, uh, there's the Sex Pistols. I had the, the deluxe version of that. It's nowhere to be seen. And I had the name of this band is Talking Heads, which I loved. It's them live. Double CD. Yeah. And probably couple of years ago it went missing. Yeah, I remember this being so good. An incredible live band. My favorite studio album of theirs is Fear of Music.
some writing, pictures, yeah it's too bad you know there's some bitterness with between the band members now. Lots of pictures. Lots of pictures. Yeah, so it goes from 1977 to 19, 1980, 1981. Thumbnail. Okay. So I'll just quickly show you what I have by Elvis Costello now, and most of these I've only listened to once or twice, depending on the album. Not in any order. My Aim is True, I absolutely love. I remember buying it when it came out, and I was so impressed with him. What a geeky guy. And then... This year's model, which was incredible. Brutal Youth, I've only listened to once. I love <laughs> Elvis as a little boy. It's excellent, though. Uh, no album here that I've listened to is like, oh, I don't like this. I like more. When I Was Cruel, excellent. Just need to play all of these more. The Delivery Man I've, I just got recently, so I haven't even really delved into it yet. Hey Clock Face, which I've shown. Ugly album cover. Great album. The Boy Named If, his latest, which is awesome. I've played this maybe three times. Look Now. Need to listen to it more. All this useless beauty. Need to listen to it more, but first spin, I liked it. This one I I know very well from 1980. Get happy, I love it. Spike, that's when I started to kind of lose interest in him. It was a good album, though, just not one of my favorites. King of America, definitely one of my favorite Elvis Costello albums. And also this, Imperial Bedroom. And Blood and Chalk, very well. And Punch the Clock is very good. I think the first half is stronger than the second half. And Armed Forces is excellent. Haven't even played this yet. National Rants. Just got it recently. And these two I just got recently and I played both of, both of them last night. And both of them, they might be my favorites of the ones I've only played once or twice. I'm so impressed, and they're so different. Elvis Costello and Bert Bacharach, painted for memory. My God, Elvis Costello can really sing a tune. Just really, really nice music.
And then this is the, the total opposite. It's a lot of it rocks like it's like early Elvis Costello. I'll, I won't say what it is in case it's <laughs> I mispronounce it wrong. But this is excellent too. Just on the first listen. So that's it. I think that's 19 Elvis Costello albums, and I think he has 19. I think he has 39. Ooh, I've got 20 more to buy. <laughs> so that's it. Uh, have a great day. Thanks for watching, and please leave a comment below and uh, like the video and check out my playlist. That's here somewhere. Bye.